Yeah, okay. Hi all, dear all espresso freaks. We are now here at uh, Betzera, uh, espresso machine manufacturer. And uh, we see the factory and especially the new showroom. And uh, here we have uh, Luca Betzera. Oh. <laughs> and uh, we now uh, show the features of the new Elisa, especially with the turbo steam and uh, PID technique. So, uh, Luca, what uh, are the main features of this uh, machine? Of this machine. Okay. First of all, I want to thank you, Marcus, Mr. Marcus Schermeyer, that gave me the opportunity to introduce our products, and I want to thank you for, to thank him for his interest in the coffee world. <laughs> <laughs> He's developing a great uh, espresso TV. So. Uh, we want to present this uh, professional uh, espresso coffee machine that is the new Elise range we have presented uh, last year. This machine is the top of the range and uh, have uh, an independent group temperature setting and uh, uh, controlled by a PID uh, system. So you can set the group temperature one by one, two different levels. We have the one group, two group, and three group. Okay, so okay. On all the range, yeah, you can yeah. have different temperature for each group. You can set also the boiler temperature by the okay. meaning of a PID. So you have display boiler temperature, uh, left group temperature, and right group temperature on the display. Okay. Also, no. the level of the water in the boiler is uh, shown on the display. This uh, display and this uh, electronic show you also the main uh, fault of the machine, let's say uh, the, the, the problem that occur uh, the most with the coffee machine. Yeah. For example, if you have uh, a, a volumetric counter that is broken and no water is coming out from the group, okay. it tell you the, the fault and I can show you easily. With a blind filter, I by, guess. By yeah. meaning of a blind filter, okay. so we simulate that the water is not coming out from the group. And if I push the coffee button, I have very nice simple, so you see. Still everything seems to work all right. Yes, but now it detects that the water is not going out to the group. So at group number two, uh, coffee um, counter, coffee flow meter, doesn't work on the group number two. After, we can use the blind filter also with the cleaning, auto cleaning software of the machine. So to start the auto cleaning software of the machine, we just push the program button and the first button and the machine starts to do an automatic cycle to clean the machine. So it activates the brewing for a few seconds in order to clean the group of the machine. So you just need to put the powder in your blind feet, yeah. press the button and it clean itself. Exactly, and also for people who are not that much instructed, you can see it here on the simple what's going on. So that's, uh, yeah, very good mate. You have, every time uh, in the display, check, uh, you can see, you can check what the machine yeah. is doing. Now, this machine um, is equipped also with a turbo steamer uh, one. It means that uh, if you want to, to supply this machine to a customer yeah. that has not professional barista, uh, most of the big uh, coffee chain that are growing and burning around the world, they have young, uh, not barista uh, employee. So, with this uh, uh, feature, you can set yeah. the, the, this temperature probe to a proper temperature okay. and you can set the amount of air that you will spray into the milk and you have ever a, um, a stable quality on the cappuccino that you will serve to your customer.
Okay, and uh, is there a screw where you can yes. adjust the now, amount of air? Added? I show you, it's really the adjusting of, the, yeah. of this feature is really easy. So yep. screw is placed yeah. under the cup warmer grid and you can close the screw turning to the right up to zero after you turn 360 and there you have a medium uh, regulation of the of the foaming of the milk after uh, depends by the different kind of milk that you have you can increase or decrease a little bit yeah. the amount of air that you will spray in yeah. your in your uh, in your milk Milk is not milk because it's also depending on the protein and the uh, amount of fat and whether it's, uh, yeah, every kind of milk is different. So this is why there is the adjustment screw, so you can just, uh, yeah, fit it to your needs and that's quite easy. And also nowadays uh, there is the uh, latte art lover and I assure you with this wand if you regulate a small amount of air you can uh, steam the milk and uh, make the draw on the cappuccino but this is something for professionals that usually prefer to use the traditional steam wand that we have on the other side of, of the machine so we have the two options manual steaming or automatic steaming so, okay, Luca, now we can uh, maybe just show how to make an espresso. Of course.